Mi Milwanyaf Cthulhu Ryla Wangya Nale Again, how are you supposed to know that? Fungui Mi Fungui Milwanyaf Cthulhu Ryla Wangya Nale Fatang Fungui Milwanyaf Cthulhu Ryla Wangya Nale Fatang Behold! Look up there! We are being observed! What? Parker! You have signed your own death warrant! I, Narakamos, tell you that in two nights, Cthulhu will reign once more! Oh. Didn't kill me that time. All right, good. Oh, got me. Fungui, Milwanyaf, Cthulhu Ryla, Wangya Nale Fatang. All right. He's just running. He's auto running. Run, Forrest, run! Her. Now you fall. <laughs> You're exhausted. Been overdoing it. Blood pressure a little high, too. You need a good long rest. Out of the question, Doctor. So this is all new to us, by the way. We didn't see any of this. You're running the risk of a heart attack, so no excitement, you understand? Take this prescription along to Matthews right away. They're pills for your heart. Careful now. At the slightest twinge of pain in your left side, swallow one and fast. You got that? I hear and obey, Doctor. And no reckless pranks. You're young, but I'm only a physician, not a wizard. Doctor, there's something I must tell you. I was chased by an Indian. An Indian? <laughs> Apart from Natawanga, who hides out in the forest, I oh, don't see who it could be. There was a certain Naramus, I seem to recall, but he must be well and truly dead by now. If you meet him, ask him for the recipe for his elixir of eternal youth. I'm not joking, Doctor. Hmm, that's what I was afraid of. I'm not a psychiatrist, you know. What you need is rest. All right, so let's get the letter. All right, let's read his notes first off. My three photo. What a night. I stumbled onto a secret gathering at the Stone Circle. The Indian in charge of ceremonies almost killed me. I had to run as I have never run before in my life. I lost consciousness. Dr. Cobble has prescribed some pills to get me back in form. Right. So let's grab the prescription and go to the pharmacy. <clears throat> <clears throat> go see Mary. The teas. So we will call this, uh, I believe this is technically day two, but I don't know. Let's just see if it's, I'll put day, no, let's just put a pill, pill, I know it's prescription, but I ain't typing that, let's just put pill letter. 
There we go. Gets rid of the bad save. <laughs> Alright, so we have... I ain't gonna fuck with it. Let's just keep going. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, so pharmacy, here we go. No, oh, where's Mary at? I want to talk to the T's. Hello, Mr. Matthews. Slap Mr. around Parker, a little bit. What a nice surprise. Oh. Uh, parchment. How can I help you, Mr. Parker? I'm trying to give you this fucking thing. It's on. Oh, prescription. What the hell's the parchment? <laughs> Darn it all. I'll get all that ready for you. It's going to take a while. I have a favor to ask. I must develop my plates, you see, and... Help yourself. It's a door at the end. I'll be with you as soon as I've finished. In case you've forgotten, you need to develop and fix your plates. That requires mixing four different chemical products. You find the products you need to mix for each preparation on the shelf. Here? Nice. Sodium. It's a four, right? Metal. Hydro. I guess I don't know how to fuck to say these fucking names. <laughs> and then sodium sulfide. Boric acid. Okay. Down. Grab the broom. So it wants me to go back over here. Potass metabisphalite. <laughs> yeah, all right. Hydrochloric acid. Hey, shit, dude. Are you have any more things I gotta grab? Oh my god, dude. What? And I'm supposed to know what to do with this shit. What a night. Uh, oh, I guess that's it. Let me just go back to the ladder just in case. Well, there's nothing up there, so. I like how the animation puts them through the floor. Alright, I guess we gotta go into the black room here. Uh... I mustn't expose my photos to the light. fucking thingy, right? I mustn't expose my photos to the light. Heading off now. It's game night tonight with friends. Alright, man. How we going, Angel? 
I will hopefully catch you over the weekend. Remember Sunday for Loom. Peace. <laughs> All right. Um. I, like right now, like. I mustn't expose my photos to the light. Oh shit! What am I gonna do? Turn the light. No, you gotta turn this, this the light off. That's impossible. I mustn't expose my photos. To oh, get off this thing, I guess. Oh, what is parchment? Did the doctor give me this? I don't even know where I even got this thing from. supposed to do in this room. Games just can't develop the film for you. <laughs> like, why is this a thing? Why, Scott? Why? What a night. My three fo Webster is friendly. He left. My three photos have been taken. I hope Mr. Meyer's plates are still good. What? Yeah, he won't interact with the light. That's the whole thing. That's over here, maybe? Ah. That switch. Alright. I figured it would have been the bigger one. <laughs> Whatever. The chemical seemed a little tired out. I'd better develop all the plates together. Okay, I guess he did. Alright. What a night. What am I putting with it, though? no way to know what, what you're supposed to use. So I doubt I gotta use all this shit. A few drops of metal. Let's continue. A dash of hydroquinone. Well, let's see the fixing solutions. Let's continue. Yeah, I know, but the game doesn't tell you what the process is, so how am I supposed to really know what I'm clicking on? I don't know what the parchment is, you won't look at it. Yeah, well, I got a guide open, I just... Try not to use it. But I don't see any other way of doing this. A spot of sodium sulfite. Let's continue. Oh, let's go down the list, I guess. Let's go right down the order, right down the little thing, I guess. I don't know.
Are they expecting the player to know how to do a film? I don't know. Alright. Potash. A sniff of potash met a bisulfite? The British scientific news will definitely fire me if I'm not able to develop a photograph. I'd better have a go again. Very well, I'll start again. I guess that wasn't right. The chemical seemed a little tired out. I better develop all the plates together. Well, the first three seem to work. Right in order. Um. All right, let's see what the guy says. Um. Back to the wall. Turn the light out. Okay, turn up lights, then go to your exposed plates. We did that. Use the the menthol and the hydro quinol, whatever the hell it is. So it is the first two. A few drops of metal. Let's continue. Okay. A dash of hydroquinone. Well, let's see the fixing solutions. Let's continue. And then the sodium whatever the hell it's called sodium uh it's because i put the wrong sodium in there did i sodium hyposulfate I don't see that. Oh, he forgot the T, and he spelled it wrong. Alright, so I guess it's this one. Thiosulfate? He has hyposulfate. This is just sulfate. Unless I'm missing something. Talk to Matthews, then give him the prescription, head back to the door, pick up four chemicals from the far bench and the four near the top of the ladder. So it should be eight. And that's what I have. So whatever he has written here is not the right thing. It's got to be this one, I guess. All right. Let's try it. The merest hint of sodium thiosulfate. Let's continue. And then the next one supposedly the potash. A sniff of potash met a bisulfite. Potash. No problem. Alright, yeah, okay. Perfect. Trying to look at this. Thank you. Thank you very much. Without you, I... You see, that's a lot better already. Don't push your luck. I'll try to remember that. I'm counting on you. So is my daughter. That comes to ten dollars. <laughs> By the way, now here's the I bill. Leave you. Will you be all right? Don't worry. The drugstore is open from eight to six. If you need more pills, just stop by and ask. Thank you again. All right, so all that stuff is gone. Develop plate, develop plate. What happened to the other one? I should have three, should I not? Whatever. All right, let's look at his... Oh, it's probably going down. Oh, there's my book. All right, let's see what this says Something now. Something strange happened today. 
I developed my photographs at Matthews. What I saw is difficult to describe. One of the plates reveals a horrific vision. Alas, I lost this proof. My plate having fallen down and crashed into pieces. Oh, that was the one that broke. Okay. No, that was the one that fell on the floor. All right. Okay, but now what? Winch. Did you manage to develop your photographs, Mr. Parker? Indeed, yes. Thank you. Did you manage to develop? Indeed, yes. Nothing there. What the hell's this dude? Oh, quite a surprise, Mr. Parker. Isn't that right? You look kind of pale. You should think about your health. You're most thoughtful, Mr. Coldstone. Aren't you a little too old to be out so late? I can take care of myself. A word of advice. Stay away from the forest. There's something about it that doesn't agree with some folks. <laughs> this game's got... It's got a vibe to it. Has nothing to do with the movie, but it just has a vibe to it. Like, if you're familiar with the movie The Fuzz, where they have the for the greater good, and the town's like killing everybody, and it's, it's kind of got that vibe to it. I'm wondering if, uh, I forget the guy's name that made that movie, if they were influenced by like one of these Cthulhu stories when they made that movie. I'm not saying this game, but it's what it kind of kind of reminds me of a little bit. Can you look at this parchment? What is this parchment that I have? This pharmacy resembles a doll's house. All right, he's just looking. He ain't looking at the parchment. All right, I don't know what the fuck's on this parchment. Okay. Um. I don't. This book doesn't tell me, you give me any instructions on Something like... Something strange happened oh, today. Uh, no. I developed my photographs at Matthews. What I saw is difficult to describe. One of the plates reveals a horrific... What a night. I stumbled onto a secret gathering at the Stone Circle. The Indian in charge... My three photos... Webster is friendly. My... Something strange... So I don't... Know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> did the doctor say where's this? Did he say something to us? I don't know. <sighs> yeah, you're right. You're right. The bird dropped it. The crow. But I still don't understand why he won't look at it. it. Don't make any sense. Yeah, the crow dropped him when he flew in through the through the uh, the seance thing. Um, what did the Vincent Price guy tell us? To go get the go f to fill the form the the prescription. We had to do the photos. What was the next thing that we were supposed to do now? Because... There's nothing in the book indicating like what we should do next. I have no idea where to use a rope ladder yet. Um, again, I don't know what the parchment actually is. Take the develop photo of the governor, maybe? I don't I don't know. Let's see if we can go talk to the no, wrong keys. Let's see if we can talk to the governor, maybe? I doubt it.
Well, this is definitely day two. This is day time. <laughs> that makes sense. Well, he's still locked out of here. A. Arlington. Uh, oh, maybe we gotta go back to that dude's house and talk to that other guy, maybe. This guy, yeah, see, he's leaving from his house. Get him! Just stand there. Or just stand there. This door is locked. Follow oh, that motherfucker. We're out running into the bushes. So, how about the photos? I just wanted, well, be sure. I'm sure you'd find them far. Be back for more very soon. All right, but don't wait too long. Goodbye now. So, what you how about the photos? I just wanted to tell you your plates are still good. Well, be sure to show me the results. I'm sure you'd find them far too amateurish. In any case, I'll certainly be back for more very soon. All right, but don't wait too long. Goodbye now. Show it to him. Key. Oh. Key. What? Oh, there's a key. What the fuck? Oh. How's the key to? So, how about the photos? I just wanted to tell you your plates are still good. Well, I'm sure you'd find them. Is that key there the whole time? I don't know where that guy went, huh? I don't know if this is a key following him or not. Let's see if it opens up the cemetery, maybe? Back to well, let's go back to that guy's house. It was locked. Oh, that's Barbara's house. I guess. Let's go and talk to her. She was rude to us last time. We're not. Mr. Parker, have you seen my aunt? She's Bible reading in the town center. No. She's Bible reading in the town center. Thank you. If she asks, please say that you haven't seen me. Will Melanie you? Griffith, Count that's who that's supposed to be. I'm thinking the name just popped in there. Uh, that quick, I didn't listen to what the fuck she said. <laughs> Disappeared like the wind. Can we get in her? No answer. Alright, makes sense. I guess that's their house. I don't know. know. Alright, we don't want to go back into the emporium again. Oh, yeah, let's see if we can use the key here. Am I on the key? Yeah. There it is. No. Oh. This looks new. Here we wanna thank you. Statue of a baby.
Uh, it's weird. I don't know how to examine things, per se. Mr. Jug? That's odd. Jug isn't answering. Huh? Mr. Jug? That's odd. Jug isn't answering. <laughs> what is blood? Magnifying glass. Hmm? Oh, I thought you were doing something. Mr. Jug? That's odd. Jug isn't answering. You don't want to look at the blood? Where are you going? Why does he keep going up there? There Good you go. Grief. It's blood. I hope Jug... Gun's still there, everything's still it's, it's really there. A statuette. I wasn't there before. A statue of a young man. It's two statues we got now. Oh, he's obviously gonna be dead in here. Okay, two books. Three bloody visible men. <laughs> the old man at the sea. I think these are all uh, Vincent Price things, aren't they, or something? Maybe Invisible Man, I think, is Vincent Price. Alright, so what was the point of that? Look at them. Hmm. It's empty. Okay. Something else. Pyramid. I already picked that up. <laughs> Picture game. Something there. You. Why won't he do anything with that? Interact with that thing, dude. <laughs> Hello? I don't understand why you won't interact with it. Magnifying glass, maybe. Well, it looks pretty interesting to me. You think you would be saying something? 
Alright, well, I guess I'm just gonna have to remember that's there, because it's giving me no indication of whether or not that's important to him or not. Alright, I'm gonna sweep it around. Hmm, right, let's look at Zit. I don't know why I can't, whatever that is over here, I can't interact with it. like a button here on that thing. Uh, so why did I pick these up? Let's look at the nameplate. T Jug. Okay. Let's look at the nameplate. T Jug. Wait, what is he look is he looking at this or the house? <laughs> He's looking at the house. <laughs> so it's, uh, Let's look at the nameplate. I still have to. It's annoying. Like how do you examine items? It's just weird that you won't like Let's look at the name. Something strange happened today. What? An Something. Right, so, so I don't know if I was supposed to grab that stuff or not, but. According to the thing, I was supposed to, I'm browsing the thingy. Yeah, pick up the statue, okay. Uh, pick up the statue. In this room. Open right cabinet. Take the statue. Apparently, more things inside this house. <laughs> Without a guy, dude, I don't know how to expect you to figure some of this stuff out. statue like it's like what <laughs> it's so easy to overlook these butterflies especially when he doesn't open these up walk to the left side of the rug you will find a key what How would you know to do that? There's no indication, like, of any sort that there's a key under that rug. How would you know to do that? I 
Like, you think, like, when you walk over to be like, oh, there's, there feels like there's something under a rug or something. Like, letting the player to know to... You know what I mean? Like... How, I mean... Small key. Alright. So, does that open this back here without trying to look at the guide? I'm assuming that's probably what this is for. But that doesn't even... But see, it's like... Goofy, if it does... How do I know that's a safe? It doesn't work. Okay, well... It doesn't work. <laughs> I was going to say, but how would you even know that's a safe if that was the case? It doesn't work. I like how he's just trying to use it. Like, I don't even know what that is. It doesn't work. Could be a glory hole for all I know. It doesn't work. I, dude, I don't know. I can honestly say I wouldn't have thought to do that. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. <laughs> I, it doesn't work. It'd be nice if I can knew what this was. Like, that's what I'm saying. This game's a bit archaic. Like, you can't just hover over stuff and be like, oh, drapes, bookcase, fireplace. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's a little archaic in design. Like, Because usually the hovers give you some sort of indication, like, what you possibly can interact with. doesn't mean you, you necessarily would be able to do anything with it. But he might just be like, oh, hey, it's a bookcase. You know what I mean? So it's like, how would you know to even to, oh, to pick the, the rug up? It's just, why? Because there's this little bit of detail here. Where there's none on this side, so it's supposed to tell me there's a, there, that the rug could be bent there? Like, now that I picked the key up, I, I guess that sort of is what that's telling me? But it's so... I don't know. It's just weird. It's just so discreet, I guess is the word. <laughs> All right, but the key doesn't do anything here. It's the same thing to do now. Now head over to the bookcase on the right. Take the youth. Replace it with the baby. St oh, like again. All right. Yeah, I, I got some problems with this game. It's like you can't beat the, you can't play this game without a fucking hit, uh, a walkthrough. There's no way. All right, I took the youth out of here, right? There is no indication after you take that youth book out of here that you can interact with this thing anymore. It tells you when there's something there because it gives you that dotted line, let you know there's a book in here. But after that, it doesn't give me any indication that there's anything left to do here. I'm supposed to put. The, the what one? The you the the young man. Uh, I don't know how to do it. Wait, what? Let me read this again. Over the bookcase on the right, take the book called Youth and replace it with the oh with the baby statue. All right, so he's not even telling me like oh that's not the right thing. Did I not take it out of that one? Yeah. Unfortunately, I don't... I'm going to have to use the walkthrough on this. There's just no... like. In all seriousness. But do you understand what my problem is, though? 
it's it's not that it isn't giving you like a hint a hint right you take a youth out and you'll be like okay stick the baby piece but there's no indication that you can interact with this bookcase anymore so why would i think to stick a statue in there Like, that to me as a player is a problem with the mechanics of the game. Like, okay, and again, I did say this earlier. This is from 93. This, this literally predates a lot of adventure games. Just about all of them, if you will. This is like one of the more original. So, the flaws with this design, I guess you can say maybe inspired all the, other, the ones that followed, or at least they make more sense. But man, without a guide, how do you how do you solve these things? Without proper indications, like indicators, it's there's no way. Like I literally left this house. I had to walk back in because I read odors oh, a key under the rug. I'm like, what? <laughs> like I said, like when you walk over this, you should be like. Hey, there's a bump, like, just the character just, hey, there's a, there feels like a bump under the rug. And I'm like, oh, okay, and pick, pick the rug up, and hey, there's a, you know what I'm saying? Like, most games do that. Even for the older ones. It's just this one's, is what it is, so it's like, I'm gonna be stuck using the guide, unfortunately. I don't like doing that, but I don't know how else I'm gonna be able to finish this game. Um, alright, so we did that. Yeah, the characters be saying something like the bookshelf seems like it's missing. Exactly. Like, all right, yeah. Now that I took the book out, maybe I can replace the book with something. But even still, like, why would he know to take the book out and replace it with a statue to begin with? Like, there should be something like... It's a puzzle, but there's nothing like explaining to you or the or the character himself that this is a puzzle all as far as i know i'm just picking up books because there's books i can click on because that's what the game tells me at this point or did anyway gave me indicators that i could pick up a book nothing else so it's like i don't know all right anyway place with the baby on the far Open the far bookcase, take the one called Old Man in the Sea, and replace it with the Old Man statue. Alright, so this one has to be the Old Man here. Uh, Alright. I don't even know how I stuck that in there last time. I don't know. Well, normally he would he would put something in his diary to give you a cue on like what you're supposed to do next. Like there's even there's like nothing even to come into this house to do this stuff. <laughs> All right, I don't understand why he's not. Head to the bookcase on the right. Take the one called Youth and replace it with the baby statue on the far bookcase. Take the book called Old Man and replace it with the... I don't know where that is. Uh, I guess maybe over here. Like, I don't even know how to interact with stuff half the time. Oh, wait. It's gone? Where'd it go? <laughs> uh, what? Put it in where? I put the baby one in here. I didn't see him do anything. Like, he literally put the baby one in there. I didn't see him actually... I didn't see no animation to do anything. It's between the white and blue books next to the statue. 
Oh, this little green looking thing right here. All right, I missed that then. Um, also on this bookcase. All right, so now we're gonna switch over to the young man. Invisible man and replace it with the young man. Oh, okay. When you click, okay, I seen him do it that time. Okay. Head through the secret door. Talk to head through the secret door. Now will the small key work? It doesn't work. Wait, what? Head over, do that, do that, do that, talk and replace with the young man. Head through the secret room. It doesn't work. Something strange happened. Head through the secret room. <laughs> secret room. Uh, he won't pick them back up. I'm assuming they're in the right spot. He just automatically placed them when I selected it in the inventory. It's like he knew where to put them, kind of thing. So I, I, I don't know. I can't pick them up again. So I'm assuming they're right. Like if he could pick them up, you'd, you'd see those dotted lines, like from him going to the item. They're not there, so I'm assuming they're in the right spot. Same as this one over here. It says, it says, head through the secret door. Talk to Jug. This has got to be the shittiest guide, I think. So what, how do you get through there? Um, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. I don't know. It doesn't work. I don't know if uh, Greasy One's still there or not. I fell asleep. <laughs> I assume the small key will work. work here. But walk through. This jug should be back here. I don't <laughs> just... Is this not... I never got this far. Um, is that not the secret room? I mean, I would... I would suspect that it is. Play for a few minutes and quit. See, it's like, I wish I could hover this and see what it is. Like, is it a lock? Is it a safe? Is it a door? That's one thing with this game that's... It's really weird. I don't look like a window to me. 
It looks like there's a button or something here. That's why I was like, like, why would you pick this key up here if you don't use it? But okay, well, the key does. The key is not for this. I can tell you that right now. I just read a little further into the thing, but I can't walk through the through the trap door, the secret door. Another area of the house. It's... I have. No idea. I mean, all indications this is a secret door or something, but... Oh, maybe something was supposed to open. Like behind these or something. But if they aren't in the right place, how do you pick them back up? Something strange. Maybe I gotta use the book again, maybe? This statue is making it very difficult to put the book back in place. Well, he said something. This statue is making it very difficult to put the book back in place. Uh, yeah, I get that. If the statue's in the right spot, can you pick it up, please? I'm assuming that's probably what's fucked up. Maybe the book isn't. Maybe it's in the wrong spot. How do you pick it back up? This statue is making it very difficult to put the book back in place. I don't know. But that's stupid. Like, then how would you know the game's over? Like, it's <laughs> got to be a way to pick them back up. <laughs> This statue is making... Just, uh... Oh, I put that one book back because there's nothing in that in that slot. Apparently, I don't need that book. I guess. Pyramids. 
So I can put those two back, but I can't put these three back because the statues are in place. <laughs> but I don't know if they're in the right sequence, though. I, I don't know. I have no way of knowing. Now. This statue is making it very difficult to put the book back in place. This statue is making. Kinda, I mean, you would think you'd be able to pick the fucking thing up, right? This statue is making it very. Let's just reload, I guess. Uh, we'll try it. I, I don't really know what else to do. Let's try it again. Oh, that means we gotta do the fucking... Gotta do all that photo crap again, too. Ugh. Hello, Mr. Matthews. Mr. Pu How can I... How can I help you, Mr. Parker? Oh. Darn it all out. Oh. Definitely saving it after this. <laughs> this sucks. The chemicals seemed a little tired out. I'd better develop all the plates together. few drops of metal. Let's continue. A dash of hydroquinone. Well, let's see the fixing solutions. Let's continue. The merest hint of... Let's continue. A sniff of potter. No problem. Perfect. How horrific. Thank you. Thank you very much. Without you, I, I'll try to... Don't worry. Thank you. Oh, hold on a second. I forget. Did she say anything to us? Did you manage to develop your photographs, Mr. Parker? Indeed, yes. Thank you. No. <laughs> yeah. 
answers that question. Let me talk to him. Why does he leave his key on the counter? And he doesn't say anything when I take it. Weird. So, I just will. I'm sure. This door is locked. Statuette. See, the other thing was like I looked in this place, in this cabinet earlier in the game. There was nothing in there, so it's like, why would you, eat, why would you think to look in there again, kind of thing. I still don't know how you're supposed to do that. The fuck, dude. Ah. All right. So I have all three statues, right? Let's see. That. Oh, let me type in there, dude. Maybe can't. Yeah, I can use numbers. Three statues. Okay. This is youth. Yeah, dude. Up youth. Take baby. Put it in there. Okay. Old man at the sea. Don't want that one. Don't care about that one either. Invisible man. All right, so this one needs to be the baby or the, the young man. Okay. Uh, Uh, 
Oh, I was the old man at the sea. Shit. Walk through the secret door and all the open. Oh my god. So I'm assuming there was nothing wrong with the last save. Head through the secret door? How the fuck you go through the secret door? That's what it was, so we guess we did rearrange the, the items incorrectly. So if you put those in correctly, you can't pick them up and you just, you basically soft lock yourself. That's fucked up. <laughs> Especially when the when the puzzle isn't that informative to begin with. Is it alive? You all right? Got red on you. So you kept your promise. Who did this? I didn't see. What does it matter now? I'm going to get some help. No, it's too late for that. <coughs> and I can still be of some use to you. <laughs> okay. Devermus Mysteries. The preachings of Laurent the Dark. Uh, so how are you gonna be used to me, dude? Get the fuck out of my way, bro. <laughs> Tired of like walking into you. Uh, anything to do with the desk? I don't, I don't understand. No. Uh, you gotta give this dude something? Here, you want your key? Got this fascinating story about an invisible man. I mean, wait. How about the... What, let's give him the parchment, maybe? Because I don't know what the fuck to do with this. Quick. Okay. Give me the parchment. They came to find it. Great <laughs> heavens. It's as I thought. It means... In his dwelling place of dead relia, Cthulhu dreams and waits. <laughs> Why didn't he say give me the parchment after he got done talking the first time? I've come across the name Cthulhu in old manuscripts concerning primitive religions. Nothing more. Mr. Parker, man has not always been the master of this world. <laughs> Many ages ago there was a race of gods. The great old ones. But how can you believe such... I have little time. Rightly or wrongly, many believe that by using certain incantations, these loathsome creatures <coughs> can be brought back to reign over us once more. How? There are portals through which the great old ones will enter in exchange for the promise of power, wealth, and immortality. Oh, oh. <laughs> there are men prepared to perpetuate the hideous ancestral cults and work for the return of these gods. <coughs> what are these gods? Where are they? They are at once far away and very near. 
Their names are Dagon, yog Safoth, nyal Afotep, Cthulhu. There are many others. The passing of Halley's Comet coincides with a favorable astral conjuncture. <coughs> they will return. Parker, you must stop them. You must. Do you hear me? How can I stop them? In two nights from now, in the center of a stone circle, the guardian of the portal will materialize. It must not be allowed to happen. <coughs> you will Kay. find here a book called the Necronomicon. Must be that in black book on the desk. Pages, you will find the formula you need. Be warned, Parker. The book drives men to madness. Do not take it from here. But if you... My desk. The message. That man will help you. Some of Illsmith's citizens will seek your destruction by whatever means possible. Read the message in the safety of your room. But... Noracomus, the sorcerer, even dead, he wields ghastly power. Dead? Remember? <laughs> More things in heaven and earth, Horatio, than are dreamt of in your... I won't forget, Tobias Jug. Still can't walk around. Alright. So I look at the message in my room, so I won't look at that right now. Let's grab a book. The Necronomicon. I'll need a key to get this book open. Alright, so that must be that small key. This little key must open the lock on this book. Okay. The ancients were. The ancients are. The ancients will be. Yog Sothoth knows the portal. Yog Sothoth is the portal. Yog Sothoth is the guardian and the key to the portal to summon him. Stand inside the circle at the appointed hour. Yagnai. Thathaik, Nagha, Yog, Sothoth. <laughs> Three times he must be summoned, and there will be light. The portal will shut. The ancients were, the ancients are, the ancients will be. Yog, Sothoth knows the portal. Yog, Sothoth is the portal. Yog Sothoth is the guardian and the key to the portal to summon him. Stand inside the circle at the appointed hour. Yagnai, Thothok, Nagai, Yog <laughs> that Thothok. Thothok. Three times. The light will be. The portal will shut. All right, so we don't... Jug has been killed. I found him in his secret library. I don't know who did it. I must be careful, since I am probably a prime suspect. Something strange happened today. The angel... Alright, so I guess I gotta... Let's save it. Pretty sure I gotta put the book back, right? Let's just say Necro Book. Almost... Uh, Said don't leave the room with the book, so No, that doesn't work. I how do you put the book back? <laughs> uh can you drop the book, dude? Said not to leave the room with the book. Alright, I guess we're gonna die. I don't know. I'll put it back in its place. Oh, there it is. Okay. Got the passage editor we needed. Alright, let's leave. Hey, we'll just leave the secret passage open so anybody can go in there and grab the book. <laughs> Future. 
All right, so go back to our room and read the message. And after that, that'll probably be uh, where I stop the stream. Uh, Mr. Uh, Parker, have you shit. just been at Jug's place? Well, no. to be honest, have you just been at Jug's place? Parker and Jug's get on real well together, that's no secret. But, I did hear yelling. But what are you- I'm going to have to ask you to follow me, Mr. Parker. Mr. Parker, you're under arrest for Jug's murder. But I'm innocent. Poor Parker. So young, and already in the next world. I'm glad I saved it. It's like, how did he even know the guy's dead? No one even came in here. I'll put it back in its place. <laughs> Jesus. It's like he literally died in the room with me. That's why I'm saying the whole town seems to be in on it, right? That's why I said it kind of reminds me of the fuzz. Alright. Um, let's save it. Let's leave it there again. I don't have to put the book back. Alright, so... Talk to Jug, we did that. Go to the desk, pick up the book, did that. Use the key, did that. Read, put it back, and leave the house. Go northeast and northwest twice. Any other way, you will be caught by Sergeant. Okay. Alright. So we definitely gotta avoid the cop. Get in there. So northeast, then northwest twice. Leave me alone, people. <laughs> Ain't talking to anybody. Oh, I'll fuck off. It's one big conspiracy in here. <laughs> Get out of here. Get out of my way. In my house. I'll trust you people. Alright. Made it, chat. We made it. Okay. Alright. Uh, let's save it again. Save it up here. Uh, well, no. Let's. Um, back in my room. Okay. Now it's wants me to read the the part or the message. The man who can help you lives where the three colors float. From there, one hundred messages leave. He's recently been looking for the Forgotten Symmetry, which is on the map everybody can see. Now, where have I seen a map of the region? And what are these three colors and 100 messages? Problem on my map. I don't have that map anymore from earlier. What the fuck? All right, we'll, we'll stop it here. So I, I need to eat. <laughs> Leave it on the first one.